Okay, guys, so this is the fourth reading of the day. It's crazy. I'm going to try. This is probably going to be a little long, this reading. I don't know. I hope to make it. The goal is, is less than 20 minutes. But this, oh, I mean, I'm still doing the other reading now. Okay, anyway. But basically, this reading is about, I want to do the reading on the Vixel, Victor Axelberg. His name is, is that right? I wrote it down here. Vexelberg. Vexelberg payments. Okay. That were made to, to, um, to Stormy, I guess. They were found. Okay, so... So tell us about this, these payments cards. Tell us about these payments. And uh, I'm trying to think. Does this prove? Okay, I'm trying to think here. Okay, because okay. So what? Is, let's just ask. Let me leave it open ended. What is this? This what does this this covery of these payments coming from a company connected to this Vex, Vexelberg person? prove about the conspiracy like collusion you know it's not it's like it's not collusion but it's a conspiracy that's what it is so what what happens what how what is the significance of this this thing okay tell us about these payments from and i i said before in the other video i did of cohen when i when i posted the part from an older reading that showed that that's like the election that's like the same system he was receiving all this money, but I want to know what is the significance to the Mueller investigation? I want to see the one. Yeah, to this whole thing. Okay, to the whole thing that we're looking into. What does this prove, or what does it mean that this guy Vexelberg paid Stormy? Okay, so what is what is going to happen now that we know? Okay, what is the consequence of this? Tell us about the, these payments, please. To Michael Cohen, how will this affect the Trump presidency? Is this proof of collusion? You know, the collusion. Collusion is actually apparently like not. A, it's not a crime. It's like it's a conspiracy. Okay, so what does this prove? Okay, I know it's like people can say, well, he's very close to Putin. And he nobody in Russia would you know do something without Putin's approval. So he's like basically paying Trump on Putin's behalf. Okay, is that what happens? Of what does this prove? Of what's going to happen? So so that's it. Okay, so Victor Vexelberg. Pain, Michael Cohen, tell us about the situation, okay? All right, so, all right, so let's do, I'm going to do now, I think I, I'm convinced that three, three and three is better, three cards, at a, you know, three positions at a time, and then I can pull more cards, because it's, it's much clearer, okay? Instead of making a, a, a humongous story, let's just keep simple so that I could do more readings and not them. Like, it's, you know, I, I like detail, but I think somehow it's sometimes concise is better. Okay. Oh, wow, this card, Jesus Christ, coming up so much, the sword. Ace of Swords, okay. Oh, look, guys, quid pro quo card. Yes, very good. Yeah, look. Okay, so this is like the victory, quid pro quo. And this is the details that were like mishandled or like disorganized, not being able to deal with the practicality of things. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, so I feel like indeed it looks like. Okay, so. All right, so let's see what else here. So Victor Vest, Vexelberg, and the payments to Cohen. Money, yeah, money. Victory or like breakthrough. It also means a breakthrough, okay. Oh, an ending. Oh, yes. Ha <laughs> ha. It's the money that ends the bitch. Oh, look, the network ends the network, okay. Okay, all right. <laughs> all right, so what else? So, guys, you see this card here, Six of Pentacles. I've always called it the, the uh, quid pro quo card. So, essentially, yes, it's, it is proof. It's saying, indeed. It is proof of the quid pro quo. Okay, let's see. Gloomy thoughts. This is a mistake, okay, or like a warning card or like something, a mistake or worrisome oh look unexpected money yes indeed uh-huh mm -hmm. oh look great happiness of fortune so there's a lot of worry because this money really can't be explained and it made trump's fortune okay guys essentially i mean think about it what if you get regular payments from someone 
I feel like Trump is literally employed, like literally, like he is employed by the by the Russians. Okay, like that. Like if you get it, it's like he gets a salary essentially. Okay, so um, I'm sorry, you you work for them. Okay, you have you have a job essentially. It's not being president; it's working for them. So. Uh oh, oh my god. It's like, guys, uh oh, coffin, ding dong, coffin delivery. So, yeah, it's the money that ends that bitch. Oh, look, the gran, oh, yes. A gran consolation. So, it's like, that's the reward. Okay. Oh, look, sick things. The proof that he's done wrong things. Okay. So, this, there's an ending because of like the way quid pro quo money, an ending. And the money can't be explained, and it's the big prize. The Gran Consola Center said, it literally, like, I think the best translation would be the big prize. Okay, and this is, like, turn also, like, creating, this is also a card of chaos in some way. This is a person dealing with changes. This is, like, not be creating changes, but then not being able to handle. And this is the network. And this is, like, you know, the fortune, but then this fortune is sick. So the end of the big prize is that be the big prize essentially ends him, I think. And again, twice, guys, whenever you have Trump lately, it's like you have coffins everywhere. Okay, so month, quid pro quo money, money ends the network. Not just him, but it ends everybody involved with him. And this is like the money was, was ungainfully obtained. Okay, this is, would be, that's what I would, how I see this. Okay, so yes, there's reason to worry. If somebody dies, it's like an, an ending here, an ending of the money. And of, of like the people. Okay, I think. So I think not only the, I think it affects Trump, but I think it affects everybody who sent him the money. Um, so that's that, guys. The question about this Vexelberg. Yes, indeed, it's a proof of. It's squid pro quo in, in the very center. Okay, and this money can't be explained otherwise. And his money is. Just, it's saying essentially that his fortune is all like this. Is all. He's, his job is to work for the Russians, is literally, okay? So that's how he gets money. So so that's that. Now, okay, so I'm trying to think. Okay, uh, okay. so I think I have, this is seven minutes in, and we have the answer. Yes, yeah, so I already am confident about this. Now, since the question was about this Vexelberg person, what happens to him as a result of this? Okay, I know he was, he, apparently, like, he was the guy, who the oligarch who was stopped by Mueller in the airport in his private plane. So what happens? What is where does where are the legal consequences to this guy? Okay, because of this. Okay, let's see. The, interesting. Okay, he's happy. Hmm. Oh everybody's celebrating. Okay. Woo. It's good for you. Moving on to something else. Oh, you know guys could be I'm like this is I'm like what cards? What does it mean? Bitch is leaving. Bitch is leaving. But I think you know, he causes Trump to leave, I wonder. You know, I'm like, oh, thank you, Mr. Vexelberg. Thank you so much. Reputation, okay. Government or, yeah, government, okay. Government or, or corporation could be the Trump Tower money, okay. So the reputation of the Trump Tower money, okay, okay. Oh, like uncovering the truth behind this. The superbia is like this, the surface, right? So uncovering the reputation underneath the surface. Uh, joylessness, the group is unhappy. Oh, really? Why? The partner, the business partner. So moving on the business partner. We're uncovering the truth about Trump. And I feel like he's like, Trump is like so angry. He's like... No, just those people. He can't. He can't believe that that the truth is coming out. So this is a false person. We know who, who. So interesting, guys. So it's weird because I. Okay. Deal. Okay. Fake person makes a deal. Oh look. Oh what? Prison. Whoa. Whoa. What? No. It can't be. Guys, it's a little interesting. Let's see here. Okay, let me lower this quickly. So just want to talk to you quickly. The original question was what happens to the Vixelberg person, he legal consequences, but it's like, it's showing him happy or that he's, you know, I, I don't know if he collaborates with the government or like he's happy to make the person move on. Okay, this sounds crazy, but that's what I looks like. He's like, 
moving on, he's like, this is the money and the business partner. Go, go somebody going to jail. This is the group of people who are unhappy, creating unhappiness through a deal. The reputation behind the scenes, like the reputation of Trump behind the scenes shows that he's fake. So the fake person made a deal goes to prison or is guilty in some way, okay? So essentially, I feel like this is a person moving on. I, you know, like I said, there was so much happiness that I feel like I wondered if it means that Trump is leaving, okay, because of this, this reputation of the Trump Tower. He made the reputation of Trump Tower behind the scenes, like there's unhappiness of the partners, but it was all like fake, false person deal. Yeah, so essentially, it's weird, guys. I feel like, yeah, what I'm not understanding well here is that there's so many happy cards, okay, and yet... So because somebody's leaving, everybody's happy somebody's leaving. And I think essentially, I feel like he pro this provides the evidence that Trump is a fake person, okay, and that he made the deal. Prison is also a card of corporations because also could also be, you know, uh, the Trump Tower itself. But I think essentially, the people, like this makes, you know, let's just one more row, one more column here because I feel like this tells me that Trump is leaving and some, somebody's leaving here because this money just nails the whole thing. It just explains. Okay, let's see. It doesn't tell me about this Velxabor person per se. I don't believe, guys, just because there's so much happiness here that it's not about Beth Velxabor. It's about what happens to Trump and that we're all happy. Okay? He, oh, yeah. This is a card so speedy. So shit gets real. What else? Uh, sad news. Okay. Oh, poverty. Okay, that's right. Letter. Yes. So, yeah, guys, I feel like this is like, essentially, yeah, I don't know. I mean, this is make could make a lot of sense that it means that something happens to this Vexelbar person. He loses money. I think it's, I don't know why, but I feel like this refers more to, to, um, it's also, oh, you know, financial documents related to, to Trump. Okay. Poverty here, people losing money if they gave money or whatever. Whoever put money in this is, is losing. So let's see. Let's see one more row. Let's see if it's, it says anything else about Trump himself. Okay. Um, okay, tarot here. Okay. Uh, restlessness. Okay. Play. Four of swords upside down. This restlessness. Okay. Let's see here. Okay. And then what else? Conversations, okay. Yeah, that show the illegality. And then, okay, Kipper. Yeah, so, yeah, illegal, illegal twice. So, so yeah, guys, I feel like, essentially, I think this is the unmasking of Trump and his finances, okay? It shows that the whole thing. And this is the conversations. I feel like, honestly, I know it sounds a little crazy, but I think I have a sense here that he does talk to Mueller. Or whatever, or this, this is like, I don't know, I don't know that this is like, I just think he, he unmasks Trump guys, really, okay, and so, so that's that, I'm not, you know, I'm not super, war like, it's weird, this is why I feel like the whole moving on card thing is the one that would tell me that there's something here where it's the, it's the end, it's almost like, I feel like we're looking at the ending already of Trump. He's already left by the time this scenario is seen, okay? It's like the proof that the money... It's really, guys, the proof that the money... Essentially, what it's saying here is that he... The reputation of the tower, the reputation of Trump and Trump Tower is totally fake, okay? That he's totally owned by the Russians, literally, okay? And that's the proof. And, uh, and like I said earlier just now, that the whole... That card was about quid pro quo, so... So, yeah, I don't think there's much here. And I think... Because the prison is is weirdly enough at the below the partner, so so I think this is Michael Cohen. Okay, anybody whose business partners with Trump and uh, and um, financial losses to anybody here involved. But I don't think no, I don't know why, guys. I don't know. Oh yes, and you know. Oh, you know. I forgot, guys. This is it. This could be it too. This five of pentacles and the letter. It's the sanctions. Like he's in the sanction list. So I feel like, oh, because he's in the, I could also be the, the talk here. Because he's in the sanction list, he decides to talk to, okay? I don't know. I don't know if it's true. 
about what ends up happening to him. I just know that I feel like this makes uh, people are so happy. The emotions are here are like people are happy that someone left, and who could that be that leaves? And it's on the same column as prison. So, so um, so that's that, guys. So I'm trying. Okay, just one more thing. Okay, quick. So just one more. Will Trump leave? Like, uh, there's so much ending to Trump here, but I want to. Is Trump gonna leave after this? Is he gonna like pack his bags and go? <laughs> Theft, okay. Always like nice people. Aggression, okay. Oh, there he is, Trump. Oh my god. Oh, go, 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 money. Oh my god, yeah. So stolen money related to Trump. Okay, I want to know. Is he going to just go? Just go, bitch. Yeah, so he's going to, I think he's going to fight. Fight aggressively because of the money. There's money. Oh my god. Oh, just go away. Go away. Shady money here, okay. Like was it before? I feel like I've seen this card. Secret money, shady money. Okay. Yeah. Again, the card of a ninety days card. What else? Conversation. So I don't know, guys. Yeah, maybe you know. I hope it's like like I said. I guess I have to like take the signs of the cards. Ninety days, something could happen. I don't know, but I don't. I I know I shouldn't say anything about timing, but but it's, that's what it is. Anyway, so I'm gonna stop here, guys. There's so many. I I feel I'm gonna take a break. This was the fourth reading of the day. And I'm going to go back to it doing other things. But it was nice. I just wanted to. There's so much going on, as you know. Like, you can never take a break. So, but I feel like, guys, it really is a very crucial time. So, so anyway, so I'm going to stop here. Okay, bye.